Okay, so here's uh, the easiest way to submit an assignment in Google Classroom, especially the writing assignment. So we'll go to lesson week 11, writing from outline, and we'll open it up. We'll open up the assignment. When we open it up, we see that there's a file with a template, story template. Okay. So the other things are just helpful things about videos about how to make a story. Uh, there's the banned word list of things that we're not going to use. So if look, we look at the story template and open it up, we see what we're supposed to do. So there's a character. So let's say the characters are a mean teacher and a nice student. Okay. And the time and place of the story will be um, now in D16. And how does the story start? The uh, story starts by teacher giving assignments in Google Classroom. And the middle part is uh, when a uh, nice student isn't sure about assignment. And the end of the story is teacher, mean teacher makes video. video and now everyone understands. Okay, so there's our plan for our story. Okay, so we want to do that first. Okay, so now we're going to use that as a basis for our story and we're going to use these checklist items here. The ly adverb, strong verb, descriptive adjective, and this. Okay, so let's write our story. So we'll say, um, hello, he was Let's say, um, we'll do this. Be, so, this is the number five sentence. Because of popular requests from parents, uh, the mean teacher uh, went back to using Google Classroom. Um, obviously, oh, that's a number three sentence, we'll put that there. Obviously, comma, it wasn't so easy to understand. Okay, uh, so, and let's maybe make that uh, a blue, so we'll call it popular request, and, or we might say, uh, mean teacher and then we say reluctantly reluctantly so there would be our orange for our adverb okay back to using cut and so obviously one so easy to understand and then might say well we need a strong verb so let's make a strong verb he salvaged the situation by making a video. Okay, and so salvage might be our strong verb. Okay, so we highlight that. Okay, so now we're ready, and we check, have we done our things yet? Did we do any banned words? Mm, no, I think not, okay. And if you look up here, right up there it says turn in, okay? So there are other ways you could do this. You could create a document and share the link, but why not just use the template? Fill it in, it's got everything you need, okay? and then you just click turn in. Wouldn't that be easier? Okay, turn in your work, up pops this message, turn in your work, Work. okay, iPad, email is, is the one that did it, that's, name, that's my dummy account there, turn in. And now it's turned in and there's nothing to worry about, and that's actually the easiest thing for the teacher to see as well is you've done it right there and the teacher can see that it's been done. Okay, so if we go back then to Google Classroom, students in writing lessons, and we go to students and we go to iPad, email, and we look at that lesson that's been turned in. There it is, this iPad email story template. And it's right right there. Okay, so that would be 
the way I would recommend. You can see how there's no room for doubt anymore. You can do it that way.